Hi, it's Shannon Heaton, and for this season of the Tune of the Month, I'm going to take very well-known Irish tunes from a solo setting to a more arranged context. Now, when I have a chance to play with guitarist Matt Heaton, I definitely get inspiration from his harmonic choices. My melodic variations might spin off of what he's doing harmonically, and some of my moves might inspire harmonies on his part. But adding backing doesn't change my job, which is to spell the tune out with rhythmic clarity and beauty, with or without backing. So here's the tune of the month, with and without guitar. This month's tune is a jig called the Lilting Banshee. I'll play it once around to get it in your ear, and then I'll break it down phrase by phrase to learn before we take it into the kitchen. Now, the priority here is a rock steady jig feel, something with a nice loping um, jig rhythm that has a little bit of an oomph on the upbeat. When your foot comes up, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, we're gonna give a little breath accent, a little rhythmic pulse, so that we bring out that nice loping jig feel. Now, one way that we can further spell out that nice uh, rhythmic uh, regularity is with an easy articulation pattern. Many of you have been asking about using the tongue. Um, when in doubt, just don't. Just go ahead and cut everything instead of tonguing. So I'm cutting my A. But um, that's only sort of a prescriptive approach. That's for people who are trying to get the um, inappropriate tonguing out of their playing. There's plenty of room for articulation in Irish music, and in a jig, it's a nice pattern to go ha ta 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 ta. It works with the jig rhythm. I'm tonguing those two A's and slurring back down to the E. And maybe there's a little slightly uh, an uneven thing between those two A's. Maybe in fact that first A is slightly shorter. Or maybe I'm just kind of resting on the downbeat just a little bit before I get to those um, upbeats again. But ha ta 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 is the tonguing pattern I'm going to use in the Lelton Banshee. One, two, one, two. And then the B part, one phrase at a time. There was a variation that I did when I played it on that fourth phrase. Instead of playing, I played. Interchangeable, those two variations. And we're off for lots more variations, I hope, and continued great rhythmic drive in the kitchen. <laughs>